Buongiorno a tutti. These are indeed difficult times for people around the world. They're especially hard for Americans, Italians, and others who are now suffering the worst effects of the coronavirus pandemic. In this dark moment, however, U.S. private industry is doing something by shining a light, by donating nearly 30 million euros, yes, 30 million euros, to Italian hospitals and institutions that are fighting this pandemic in Italy, and they're not through donating yet. This is not surprising, because for decades, our business community has played a pivotal role in providing materials, technology, and capital where it's needed most. In our capitalist democratic society, free enterprise can often make the difference when governments cannot do it alone. These contributions are evidence, as if more were needed, of the incredible historic friendship that exists between America and Italy. It is a friendship that is firmly rooted in shared values, including that very love of democratic freedom that we enjoy. I'd like to give a special thanks today, though, to the American Chamber of Commerce in Italy. It has courageously been led by President Luca Arnaboldi and Managing Director Simone Crolla. The Chamber has been instrumental in coordinating much of the assistance being provided by the United States companies in Italy. We are most grateful for their support. My friends, this is not easy, but we will get through this together. The time is not far away when together we will declare victory. And when future generations look back at recorded history, I know, I am confident that they will learn that Italy and the United States stand together now and in this crisis as we have in crises before. We will overcome this together. Grazie.